everyone. I am Jaris Devendra Prabhu, Australian Professor, Department of Commerce, Kaiser College of Arts and Science for Women, Pritchangodu. Now we are going to discuss in cost accounting. Right. So first of all, the meaning of the cost accounting. Cost accounting is a business practice in which we record, examine, summarize and study the company's cost spent on any process, services, product or anything else in the organization. This helps the organization in cost controlling and making strategic planning and decision on the improving cost efficiency. So basically cost accounting was used by the manufacturing industries, manufacturing unit uh, for uh, it helps to uh, fixation of the price and also reduce the uh, losses and uh, increase the profit. So basically the cost is incurred the the meaning of uh, raw material everything will be produced in the industrial unit. The so most of the industrial unit mostly prepare the cost accounting. Right. The next one is we have discussed in futures of cost accounting. It is a sub field in your accounting. It is the process of accounting for cost provides the data to the management for decision making and budgeting for the future. If the company was uh, before going to any decision making regarding the production oriented process, they have to be verified the cost accounting. According to the cost accounting status, what their report said, the, the, based on the report, the company will take in any decision. Right? It helps to establish certain standard costs and budgets. So cost also one of the play the important role in budgeting in company. So we are the we have various kind of budgets we will discuss in next topic. But here it's a provide it help to certain standard cost and budgets provides uh, cost data that helps in the fixing of price of goods and services. It is also great tool to figure out the efficiency or unit of the process. It can discuss the wastage of the time and resources. Yeah, these are the important features. The next one is advantages of cost accounting, measuring and improving efficiency. So once the company was uh, followed the cost accounting, have to be identify the measurement and improve their quality as well as the efficiency of the production. The next one is identification of the unprofitable activities. The next one is uh, fixation price, uh, price reduction, control over stock, evaluates the reason for losses. So these all are the important advantages of the cost accounting. The next one is element of the cost. So the element of the cost is they are given the direct material and indirect material. So the direct material, all material which becomes an integrated part of the finished product and which can be assigned to the specific physical unit. Yeah, this is the cost is uh, cost or material whatever it is it will be classified majorly two types one first one is direct then next one is indirect so the indirect is all material which becomes an integral part of the finished goods it is really it's a visible we can identify so a part of the so product that is called the direct material then another one is, is um, all material components uh, specifically purchased or produced so requestation from the stores the primary packing material, the cotton wrapping, the cardboard box, the everything should be the primary packing material. The purchaser of partly produce the equipment. Then indirect material, all material which is used for purpose to the business and which cannot be assigned to them specific physical the units. The consumable stores, oil, then waste, the printing and the stationery, this is all materials are comes under them. Then indirect material. Yeah. The next one is cost cost sheet. So these are the important uh, formation of the cost sheet. Uh, this was projected the how the cost will be calculated through the accountancy. The first one is we are identify the direct material consumed. After that, prime cost, then work cost or factory cost, then cost of production, then cost of goods sold. Then last one is sales. So this is a hierarchy method to identify the cost sheet whether we are working the uh, step by step. Yeah. So the next one is the cost sheet is mostly available for every manufacturing industry. Once the manufacturing industry follow the cost accounting, they have compulsory prepared the cost sheet for to identify the sales or price 
according to the distributions of overheads. Overheads having them, selling overhead, uh, profit uh, distribution overhead, so every overhead is available. So according to the overheads, they have to be uh, just classified at the cost rate, so prime cost, work cost, so distribution overhead, selling overhead, administrative overhead. So these all are the importance of the cost issues. We know of the separate thing as well as the real profit and sales. So thank you so much. Thank you for watching the video.